currently this would be my first vlog I'm at my cousin's house waiting for my other cousin to get home I'm going to fly in the US to watch GOT7 for the first time in LA part day 2 actually And the rest is for my cousin and my friend. My other cousin over there washing dishes, washing my mess. She loves me. It's okay. <laughs> Gotta get ready soon and get in the line. <clears throat> It's three to six. I'm waiting in line. Well, sitting. For three more hours. I got P1 tickets. And I got O. Been here for a good like three hours already. Not three more. I'm waiting for food. I got banners.
Got seven was amazing, even though I had to wait for six, six hours, six, seven hours, but it was worth the wait. And everyone pushing me, I was like in the front by the the rails, so I got pretty good seats, no seats where I stand. When they first came out. We were all screaming like crazy. I was trying to keep my cool, but it didn't work out. I was screaming, screaming like a fan, and I got seven. <laughs> they were so good, and they're so much better in person. It's so much better. 
in real life than on a screen. Their dancing was amazing. And their singing was amazing. They were super funny. Bam Bam was being his usual, usual self. And we dabbed with him, of course. <laughs> and then, what else? I say. It was just amazing to see them in person. Uh, then after the concert, it was it was so cool with the confettis right in front of our faces. And after their concert was done, we got a photo pass to go take pictures with them. We were the first ones in line, but there was these other girls that were in front of us. But it kind of we kind of thought they were a group. So we were, they were gonna sit next to each other, but they end up sitting separate from each other. So my group got a little bit messed up. My cousin sat in the back and got to touch them. I, me, and my friend sat in the front, didn't get to touch them. And when we were leaving, Jackson was like waving to us, like, "Hey, what about me? Are you going to hug me? I wanted to." Oh, but I was so like emotionally like not prepared for this that like I was just like I just walked past them. I didn't even I stared at them and I walked past them because I didn't know what to do. I was just so like and also there was a lady that like was pushing us out because everyone needed their um, everyone had to like take their picture. But but afterwards like we were screaming <laughs> but it's funny because like I, the only people that I focused on was Jackson and Mark even though my, my bias was JB but I didn't, I didn't even look at him like what and then after the concert me and my cousins all had like all had post concert depression we were, we, were, we were trying to avoid not, we were avoiding listening to their music for a good like day, not even a day, a few hours. Then like I was just like, you know what, I have to listen to them. And basically it. And I hope they come next year or I'll fly to Korea and listen and go watch them over there. But I was really satisfied and happy and it was probably the best thing this summer for me okay. I don't think I ended it